One of my favourite series of racing games has got to be Ridge Racer. Every Ridge Racer game is a classic. But this time Namco have decided to switch things up a bit, get somebody else to make it, make it a bit more gritty, make it a bit more violent, make it a bit more action movie-like. Let's see what it plays like. The warning signs are there from the very beginning. Press B to drift, it says. Since when did you need a button to drift in a Ridge Racer game? Doesn't get much better after that. They're giving these big wide tracks, smashing through windows and smashing into walls because you kind of control the bloody tank you're driving. Aye, the cars in this just don't feel like cars. They don't feel like Ridge Racer cars for a start. They feel like tanks on soap. And press A to destroy targets. When do you ever need to destroy targets in a Ridge Racer game? In fact, when do you, why do you need to destroy targets in any racing game? It's just this weird indication of the kind of Michael Bayism of games nowadays. Everything's got to be fucking brash and loud and in your face and explosions everywhere. And you're skidding about bashing into things and you can't even race properly like you used to be able to in a Ridge Racer game. I mean, don't get me wrong, it looks the part and it moves along at a feral pace, apart from when it's going into slow motion to show you the next big thing that's dropping down in front of you. But it just doesn't feel right, it feels soulless and it feels like it's just, it's no finished yet. Obviously they've got a bit of time to fix it and iron out a few of those niggles, but until they make the cars feel like actual cars rather than concrete blocks on pools of ice, I don't think I'm going to be buying this one. I mean look at this, just, just pointless. Well, that's a crying shame. It doesn't look like Ridge Racer, doesn't feel like Ridge Racer, it certainly doesn't play like Ridge Racer. And more than anything, the crying shame is that even if the Ridge Racer name wasn't there, it still wouldn't play that well. I, I just couldn't control the car at all, and it wasn't my fault, it was the game itself. And I know it sounds like making excuses, but it's just not that much fun. This one, I think this is going to be the first time I'm going to give a Ridge Racer game a big bye. Not the good times. <laughs>